Hey everyone, welcome back to Ebony with Genghis. So yesterday we did a little bit of a science experiment. Someone wrote Ebony customer service about sub-generals and their debuffs and their ascensions stacking or not stacking. Ebony customer service told them the wrong answer, so we tested it and got you the answer. Long story short, they stack. You can use the same sub-general 10, 11, 12 times and it will work. And now I want to do another uh, little experiment for you guys that I always hear all the time. I always hear people uh, debating, does monster march speed and monster and regular march speed make any difference in particular on the way back from a monster? It's easy to test on the way there. You don't even have to send the march. You could just look at how long it's going to take. So we're going to do a test here and show you. So right here, I have it on a neutral uh, horn. It's march size capacity. Okay, so let's set a rally. I won't launch the rally. And there we are. It's going to take us nine seconds in the bottom right corner. Now... I'm going to change the gear over to march speed. So nine seconds. And that was my number eight. And now it's going to take eight seconds. March speed should be faster than no march speed. So that's our eighth preset. And now we'll change it over to monster march speed. And let's see and eight seconds so it might be a little bit too close for it to actually make a difference there so let's see from a little further away we'll have to find a, another monster a little further away i thought it would uh work out there but uh oh, oh someone's tiling and we have a tile war going on the whatever someone else can get it i got no interest in it I try and stay out of those things. I just do, you know, if there's a bubble drop, okay. So anyways, here we go, right here. 39 seconds with Monster March Speed. Let's bookmark that. Now let's go into regular March Speed. So 39 is the time to beat. And it's 41, so it is slower. So now, uh, the question is on the way back, and obviously the last one was too close to do it. So what I'm going to have to do here, I'm going to have to, we're on regular march speed. So what I'm going to have to do here, I'm going to send a march, and I'm going to lose on purpose. So I'm going to waste stamina for you guys. Ah, All right, so I'm going to send this march regular attack i'm gonna go with the exact same uh general and i'm gonna send one troop one ground troop so it's gonna take 41 seconds and let's see how long it takes on the way back so uh we tested this before in battlefield one time uh when i was in neff alliance we were marching towards like the Phoenix at the end of the battle. One of these, uh, you know, in Neff, you get the luxuries of just being bored in battles easily. So it came up then. So it was about two years ago that uh, that happened because I remember Warzilla and Pig were the two guys who were debating and arguing over it. And it turned out that at the time, so let's uh, keep an eye here because it's going to start returning. It turned out that Monster March Speed was faster on the way home. It wasn't just on the way there. So this is regular march and it's returning that was a minute four so uh i know that when i used to when i first started out because the th theory is that it's no longer marching to a monster right now this is marching to a castle so it shouldn't be any faster uh i remember when i was first starting out I used to change my gear sometimes. Like if I was online and had a lot of time and was just, you know, messing around, wasn't too concerned about stuff, I would uh, change my gear when things would be on their way home. Like I would join the rallies and then I'd switch over to regular march speed for the way home. And then I later found out that that was uh, 
not a good way to do things. So now we've switched over to Monster March Speed. And let's go back over to that baby Yasha. And we're about to launch on it. And a minute four, so 64 seconds is the time to beat on the way home. So let's get ready to launch. And we'll just send in there. So we're already faster at 39 seconds. Oh no, I, I rallied. Oh, why do I do that? So uh, I get into the, at the gem then. Not only stamina, but gems spent. I just have a habit. I also, uh, funny, whenever we get into a solo war and then I go move to a different spot of the map, I start sending rallies, usually on the first day or first go at it because I'm just so used to starting rallies. So I'm not into soloing. And, uh, yeah, anyways, wonder if that happens to anybody else, just muscle memory. So a minute four, and we're about to turn around here in five seconds. And there you have it, one minute, so 60 seconds. So we beat it by at least four or five seconds. So there you have it. Monster March Speed is the way to go when you are rallying all the time. Uh, let me know if uh, that confirms your belief. Anything else that you guys ever want me to experiment, show you guys you have some debates in your alliances. And uh, I'm going to have a special, I really hope, tomorrow on uh, Mayans, the, this one here. Sounds boring, Revelation of Maya. Look at my server, man. Like, it's so hard to get Caesar. I need to get Caesar, and I got to finish my covenant on uh, Marcus Agrippa. And I've got a tip from a subscriber, viewer, who said, this is how you got to do it. I know we all know how to do it, but he was like, this is the exact way to get the highest score possible. And I think it's 11,550. And he says he gets it all the time. So I'm going to do it. And then I'm going to show you guys. And hopefully I get that covenant done. So like, subscribe, leave a comment.